Hey guys, I'm Chris from the Silver Symbol Channel, and in this video we're checking out a new robot mower called Limo. Now there are lots of robots out there, I've shown you many on my channel, but this one is completely different. It's got a track-based system, and this is a front deck mower. Now this is very unusual in the robotic space. In fact, this is the only mower on the market today that has its mowing deck in front and uses real lawnmower blades. Now these ones are small, but these are the same type of blades you would have on your regular mower. Up until now, every robot mower on the market has used these tiny, small razor blades. Now these do work, but they're certainly not going to last as long and they don't have the same amount of power. When you put a mowing deck in the front of a lawnmower, you gain a lot. That allows the deck to float independently of the machine. Nobody has a flat yard. In fact, here in New Hampshire, I've got all kinds of hills. So when I used Limo, what was shocking was to see the deck kind of undulating around the different dips and even holes that I have on my lawn still maintaining a good cut. And I think by far, if you look at this footage of the actual lawn mowing and the finished result, I was absolutely amazed by the way that the lawn looked how straight and clear the lines were on the lawn, and the fact that this mower has a 16 inch deck. And 16 inches maybe doesn't sound that big, but in terms of robots, that is huge. That is a super wide deck. Now before I even get into showing you the details, I wanted to show you the results first, because every time I share a robot, people complain, and they say that I never show the thing actually mowing grass. Every mower I've ever tested here was getting hung up on this extreme angle. And I mowed my entire lawn multiple times without a single issue. This mower never got stuck, it never hung up, it never dug a rut in the lawn. The most important thing on any mower, of course, is going to be how does it cut and how does it look. And in terms of those two qualities, this Limo has absolutely performed near flawlessly on my lawn. And I think if you look at the finished results, you'd agree that this is a pretty good look. But the second reason that I'm saying this is the best mower made is technology. This is one of the only companies that finally put a lithium iron phosphate battery into their robotic mower. Lithium iron phosphate is first off safer, but more importantly, it's going to last longer before you see any loss of charging. Normal lithium ion batteries, which are what is basically in every other robot mower out there today, will have a charge cycle rating of about five to 800 cycles before you start to see a loss. The third reason I really like this machine is the technology around how it navigates. You don't need any wires with this thing. It is using GPS and RTK and all sorts of technology to work. But in terms of setting it up, it was surprisingly easy. This is the first robot I have ever used that was able to get this far from the base without any signal loss whatsoever. I've got these huge trees in front of the receiver and I'm around the corner of my house and somehow this antenna is able to communicate with the mower. That is a game changing feature. Everything you need is included in the box. Set the base somewhere near an outlet. Now they do give you very long cords and this design is pretty clever. The base and the antenna can be plugged into each other, requiring only one electric outlet to run the whole thing. But if you're in a situation where you want to put your base say on one side of your house and the antenna on the other because maybe it's just got a wider view of the sky, you can do that and they do actually include two separate AC chargers in the box. From the time that I got the mower out of the box to when I was actually mowing was about one hour. Now it didn't really take an hour to kind of set the mower up. The base and the antenna and stuff were just a few minutes. What takes a bit more time is you've got to draw a map, but it is easy. The way this works is similar to other robotic mowers on the market and you simply drive the mower around. It's kind of like a game controller at this point where you follow the border of your property. You want to get close to your border, but you're never going to be able to avoid edging your lawn completely. So get as close as you can without having these tracks run into your beds and then go around the outside of your property. Once you've defined those zones, the mower will actually create a pattern where you will get straight stripes on the lawn. And as you can see, these things are laser sharp. Most mowers that I have tried do have some wiggle to the stripes. And with the 16 inch mowing deck, it looks really good. And some people ask about zones. A zone is if you had your lawn on one side of your yard and maybe have a walkway and then there's another section of grass on the other. That would be two zones. And with this machine, you can define multiple zones. Now this mower was only for me to use for the review. I will be sending it back, but I can tell you that after a month, this mower did perform flawlessly. And I really mean that. There were no issues whatsoever with traction, charging, software bugs, but by far the reception and the quality of this signal was absolutely amazing to me. The other huge win with this mower is the price. Now right now they're doing a pre-order again because they basically ran out, but it's no longer a Kickstarter. This is a manufactured product. You can order it and get it. And I believe they're delivering now in about three weeks. This mower is rated for around 1.75 acres in one 
one charge. That is pretty exceptional. Now I would say this would be good for a lawn anywhere from about a third of an acre up. If you've got a much smaller lawn, I really think this is probably overkill and not gonna be what you're looking for. And if there's anything I didn't cover in this video, be sure to leave me a comment below. And please subscribe to the Silver Symbol channel if you're not already for more videos coming up.